A former Lee Summit teacher is accused of sex crimes with a student. Jiang Ji faces two counts of sodomy. According to court documents, other students had alerted the school district to the situation. So how should parents respond in cases like this? KCTV5's Caroline Sweeney spoke with an expert and got some advice for parents. The Lee Summit community is reeling after a teacher here at Lee Summit North High School was charged with sex crimes against a student. It also leaves unanswered questions about how to prevent this from happening again. This man, Shi Young Ji, faces two counts of statutory sex crimes after he told police he had sex with a student at Lee Summit North High School. The male student, who's not 18 years old, had asked Ji to tutor him in math and Chinese. A local group says it's important to talk to students so they feel safe enough to report Support in appropriate relationships. Parents should absolutely look for the resource that, that makes the most sense for them. There are resources online for parents and kids that Harold says can help start conversations. According to court documents, G and the student left school and came here to Lowenstein Park. In situations like that, Harold says a student teacher relationship could have a power imbalance and it's important for students to know what they can do. We talk a lot about like the reason equal relationships are healthy is because you feel like you have a say, you feel like you can tell this person if they're crossing your boundaries or making you feel uncomfortable. But the issue at the high school did not go unnoticed. On February 27th, an assistant principal confronted G one week after other students reported seeing the pair together at Starbucks. Court documents show that G admitted he knew it was wrong to have a relationship with a student. In Lee Summit, Caroline Sweeney, KCTV 5 News.